Hi, my name is Fiona Pincannon. I'm an artist from Spiddle in County Galway on the west coast of Ireland. Um, I specialise in watercolour paintings of my local landscape and sunsets. Okay, so this is just an installation view of my work on display at the Art Source Art Fair in the RDS in Dublin. So the first painting I'm going to talk about is a painting of the Galway hookers, which as they were in David's painting earlier, are traditional Irish fishing boats, which are found around the west coast of Ireland. Um, they're known by their black hull and their rust red uh, sails. They used to be used for transporting turf around the areas, but now they're leisure. Um, and they have races during the summer, which are called Rossi Nagurki, which is um, Irish for Kirk races. So these were races back in Letcher Moor in Connemara. Um, so I took a photograph and then I come home to the studio. I draw it out in pencil and then I start, <coughs> excuse me, um, adding washes of colour to the painting. So it's quite a slow process. I tend to work on about 10 paintings at the same time because you have to let each layer dry. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so that is that one. So the second uh, kind of work that I do is primarily colour. I love colour and we're very lucky here in the West Coast to have beautiful sunsets. And with the bad weather we have, we actually get very dramatic skies, which can be very beautiful. So this is, I went back to Carl Strand, which is a beautiful beach in Cairo, back in Connemara, and it's my go-to place to kind of clear my head and, you know, uh, inspire myself. So when I was back there one day, and just this beautiful golden sunset, bursts of yellow, oranges, golds, <coughs> excuse me, and just reflecting on the water. Um, again, washes and washes of colour, let them dry, build it up like that. Okay, so the next one is Night Falling Spittle. Uh, so this was actually a sunset outside my house, um, quite dramatic, uh, it's kind of like a shepherd's delight, pinks, purples, oranges, yellows, and then you've got your dramatic indigos and purples. So this one actually took about six months of, you know, layer, dry, layer, 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 and um, the silhouette of the landscape at the bottom there. And then the last one I'm going to talk about is um, this heritage series I started last year during lockdown because none of us could go anywhere. So I went through my collection of photographs and it's something I'd be meaning to do for years because I love drawing. So um, this is one of the Galway Cathedral, which is in the middle of Galway town. It's a very imposing building. I think it's very beautiful. So what I do, so it's black ink pen on very heavy um, watercolor paper. So the trick with drawing is if you have a light tone, a medium tone and a dark tone, you create form and structure. So I use the white paper as the, the light tone. Then I use um, the kind of cross hatching to create kind of the mid tones and then the really dark to create the depth. And I think that brings the drawing together. So these, because there isn't the drawing process involved, these could take up to a week, um, but they're much quicker to do than the watercolor paintings. So I've about 20 to 25 in my heritage collection and um, I'm very pleased with the way they turned out. So, anyway, so that's me. So I'd like to thank the Crafters of Ireland and the Irish uh, American Business Network for organising this event and to everyone for listening to me and to my fellow exhibitors. Thanks very much.